Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Service Now 911. I hope you are getting as much as you can from these videos. If yes, then please subscribe to the channel. You can go through the playlists here and find out the suitable topic which you want to discuss, which you want to learn. In today's topic, we are continuing the CMDB part and discussing the product model, okay? So what is a product model? It is basically an out of box table which is coming in this uh, uh, demo instance as well, okay? Its name is CMDB underscore model, okay? So what it contains? So this table contains products and what are these products? These are nothing but uh, various applications in your organization, okay? So products are specific versions or configurations of a product used to manage various applications on now platform. So in order to manage and track various applications which are there in your organizations, okay, we use these products in CMDB or you can say in ServiceNow CMDB. By creating these products, we are able to identify the product owners, teams, product status, its compatibility with other products, its product catalog. It means each and everything which is associated with an application or a product. Everything along with the life cycle of the product, you can see it here. Let me show you the product table here. You see this is the product table and these all are the some out of box applications which are available here. So you see Acrobat kind of application. You see it's journal information. It's all tracking. It's appreciation. It's current cost. What is the status? Okay. Any comments? It's model barcode. Who is the owner? What is the next version? Everything is available here along with the license information what is the current license which we are using okay what is the type of the license then suite component then suite parents if it is coming in a suite it means if it is coming in a bundle okay in that case it will come here it's upgrade information it's downgrade information licensing information it means how many licenses of this particular product is being assigned to various uh, departments or various users okay what is the cost and the product catalog you see the various uh, related links here show product life cycle for all versions okay so these all things are coming out of box you can make some customization according to your organization but in a nutshell a product model table contain all the applications which are used or being used and being updated by the CMDB one thing you have to keep in mind that the product model is not a CI you see here the product model table are not CIs, okay? The configuration item can use these model ID attributes to reference the product models. Okay, so these product models are used by various CIs so that we understand, okay, this particular CI belongs or connected to a particular model. Let me show you that field. Let's go to configuration item table. You see the model ID field. This is the field which is referencing to the product model. So for Apple MacBook 15 inches, you see Apple MacBook Pro 15 inches is being attached. Okay, so separate models has been created. As of now, out of box, there are seven type of product models which are available. So you see here, application, software, contract, facility, hardware and consumable and services. Okay, you can increase or decrease these types and maintain the product hierarchy of your organization. So I hope this is it for today's uh, product model discussion. If you have any question, let us know in the comment section. Thank you so much. Bye bye.